Ralph Little has waded into a row between Piers Morgan and Gary Lineker on Twitter. The Death in Paradise actor, 42, implied talk TV star Piers was abominable in a tongue-in-cheek post. The row first broke out when former Good Morning Britain host Piers and footballing legend Gary debated who was the best footballer of all time. Piers, 56, is a huge fan of Cristiano Ronaldo, while Gary was singing Lionel Messi's praises. After Gary, 61, claimed Ronaldo and Messi were both greats, Piers responded, It's perfectly sensical, Jugs. Messi's clearly lost his magic since leaving Barca. Ronaldo's kept it at many clubs slash countries including back at United now. That's why he's the greatest of all time. Gary shot back, so you're judging two of the greatest players of all time on how they perform in their mid-30s when they're both past their best. I don't care who you or anyone else thinks is better, it's not important, but a lack of respect for either is totally unwarranted. The argument continued back and forth as neither of the broadcasters wanted to back down. It began to get personal, as Gary wrote, players will always be judged on their prime years. By your criteria Maradona would be considered average. I know you're always texting Ronaldo and desperately want him to like you, but you can do that without disrespecting other greats. He added, watching the game, I think I may have just got a glimpse of your feet hanging from at Cristiano's shorts. This infuriated Piers, who responded, mate, when it comes to sycophantic obsequious AE licking. Your fan girl worship of Messi even as he fades into mediocrity is in a class of its own. To this, Gary simply responded with a screen grab of Piers' pinned tweet, documenting an exchange he had with Ronaldo. You have good abdominals, it reads, alongside a photo of the pair together. Thank you, at Cristiano. Yours aren't too bad either. As he reminded Piers about this post, Gary added. At this point, D.I. Neville Parker actor Ralph decided to get involved. Abominable? He replied, pretending Piers had mistyped his tweet. Piers has yet to respond to Ralph's jab, but the TV host rarely misses the chance to get involved in a public war of words.